clear sky, sunshine, 25 degrees. None of these things are coming to Cork this week. I'm Thomas, and this is Blame the Weather. Hey there, and welcome to Blame the Weather. As you may have guessed from the intro, the unsettled weather that we've been dealing with over the last couple of days is set to continue. In fact, it will continue well into the Easter weekend. The reason is that we're in the path of a number of strong low pressure areas over the Atlantic. And as anyone who knows anything about meteorology knows, low pressure areas are always bad news. This um, also means that the cooling trend that we've been experiencing over the last couple of days will continue. Although snow is likely not on the cards for anywhere outside of the mountains. Now uh, Wednesday, March 28th is going to start off cool with temperatures in the morning of around 2 degrees. Daytime highs won't be anything to write home about either with around 7 degrees and by the nighttime we're back down to 0 degrees, maybe even a bit below. It will be a dry start to the day, however around lunchtime some light rain is going to move in and stay in the Cork area up until the evening. This doesn't mean continuous rain, but be ready for rain charts or short periods of persistent rain pretty much throughout the day. Winds are going to be mostly calm, although they will be picking up around lunchtime for a period. But even then it won't be anything dramatic. Now Thursday, March 29th, is going to start off equally cool, once again with temperatures around 2 degrees. Once again, the temperatures around lunchtime will be um, around 7 degrees, maybe 8 if we're lucky, but I wouldn't bet on it. While nighttime lows are actually going to drop into the negative with minus 1 degrees. For a change, the day will start with strong rainfall. In fact, that strong rainfall um, will move in around midnight and stay with us uh, until around lunchtime, clearing in the very early afternoon. Now that doesn't mean clear skies, we can still expect some light rain or rain showers um, throughout most of the day, but it won't be anywhere near as bad as during the morning. Once again, winds will be mostly calm, although once again some strong gusts could be hiding in the whole thing. Good Friday, March 30th, is going to start off as cold as Thursday ended with minus 1 degrees. Daytime highs will rise to 7 degrees, however the night will once again be cold with around 0 degrees. It will be dry for most of the day for a change, however some light rain will move in towards the afternoon and evening and depending on how quickly the temperatures drop, some light snowfall might be possible, although I don't think we'll see any accumulations at all and I'm still skeptical about the snowfall itself. Even. Now the general outlook isn't really much better than the week we just had. The Easter weekend will continue to be cold with um, Saturday actually being just a bit warmer. However, rain is possible throughout the weekend and in fact by Easter Monday we can expect some seriously strong rainfall to move in by morning and stay in all day. Winds will also be strong on Easter Monday so it's best to tie down, uh, tie down any remaining Easter eggs because otherwise they're gonna go flying. Unfortunately, um, a real warming trend does not appear in any of the weather models that I've checked. In fact, it looks as if we're in for very cool temperatures, unseasonably cool temperatures, until, until mid-April at the earliest. And that's all for me. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, despite the grim forecast, um, please click the thumbs up button. It really is a lot of help for small channels like mine. If you enjoy seeing these kinds of forecasts and don't want to miss any more of them, please click the subscribe button and be sure to click the little notification bell to never again miss a video. And if you have any feedback or criticism, please put it in the comment section below. I'm eager to hear from you and every bit of feedback helps me make this channel better. Once again, thank you very much for watching and remember, don't blame me, blame the weather.